Okay, here's the frigidaire again. So what would happen is, when you turn these, the outer switch is the one that's most commonly used. If you turn them, and then you turn them off, they wouldn't shut off, the light would stay on, they would be a little bit hot. You have to turn it all the way to the high and then back to the off position to shut it off. And so basically in order to get this off, there's these sleeves that go around these shafts. You have to take these sleeves off once you take the knobs and the sleeves off, then this thing will just pull off the front. Once you pull this off, notice that switch is still hooked on, the light, the oven light switch is still hooked on. Then you have these screws here, 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 and here. Then you can get to the back of it. See, so these new ones are different from these. But if you look on them, you'll see they're all labeled. They have different L1, L2, H1, H2. And then these are all labeled here. They look different. This is what, uh, this is the Sears part replacement. As long as we follow the same pattern, we should be good. This is that frigid air. Oh, Electra Lux. I get the power shut off. And I do wear gloves too. Okay, so I made sure to label these so that we know, because the letters are hard to see, we don't have not much light here. And then plus we've got the forest fires blocking out everything. So, uh, I've labeled each one of these. I label them as I take them off, and I'll put them exactly as labeled here. This one here I've already tested, works fine. The shaft is a little bit long. What I'm going to do is um, glue glue the knob on basically because um, it is still a little bit sloppy I could put some tape around this uh, to uh, clear up the slop it's going to protrude a little bit further than normal but only like a quarter of an inch which should be fine if worse comes to worse I could grind that off okay got them all on so I tested that one so I know this one's not going to blow out I don't have the power on yet, but I'm going to uh, turn the power on in a minute and check this one. Um, the only thing I was concerned about is whether this part goes up or down. This one here goes with the numbers down. And so it seemed to be working fine with the numbers down. This one here seemed to be oriented with the numbers up. 